Parents that have students in the Hilliard City schools knew that today was the last day of school, but that didn't make it any easier for them. For the kids that were out on Friday, it was just kind of a bummer for the kids to have to go back to school on a Monday. The problem started back in December when Hilliard City Schools got complaints about students returning from winter break on January 2nd. That was the official federal holiday. Deanna Hand was surprised that the district didn't catch it when scheduling for the school year. It was very poor planning. A lot of educated professionals, the, the schedules are made up so many years in advance that clearly everyone missed it. I, I don't understand that. So the district decided to add another day to the end of the school year to stay within state standards, making the last day of school a Monday. I would have preferred it had been maybe another day that they could have taken off, maybe another holiday that they could have changed in the winter time. Hand said because her kids had to go to school, they missed a chance to travel. My husband travels and we could have traveled with him over the weekend through part of this week, but since kids had school on Monday, that wasn't an option. Hilliard City Schools would not talk to me about this on camera, but they did give me a copy of the letter that was sent to parents. In it, it explains that the winter break would be extended through January 2nd in observance of the federal holiday. Because today was planned as the last day of school, it won't cost the district any additional dollars. The district said they had positive feedback, and that's why they made the change to the school schedule. The district also stated they made accommodations for families that had to travel, and some students were excused for the day. In Hilliard, Steve Wayne for NBC4.